Good morning my love bugs, rise and shine. Today I'll be showing you guys how I do my simple vanilla scented shower routine. Today is nice and warm, ready to go out, and now I need to prepare for that. The first thing I like to do in the morning is brush my teeth, gotta get those pearly whites. Today I'm just using a basic Colgate toothbrush that is charcoal and also toothpaste. And rinsing it down with some Listerine, mixing products and companies, I see. Once again, we're going to be using the Aveeno Positively Radiant Skin Brightening Daily Scrub. Oh my gosh, I'm about to finish this and it makes me so sad. But this is a great way to get brightened skin, you know, fix the uneven um, skin tone, also helps my skin feel so soft and smooth. As you can see, it gently infoliates with cleansing your skin and it helps improve your skin's appearance honestly i do feel like my skin looks a lot more radiant every single time i use it and it's also very hypoallergenic i don't know how you say that but basically my skin feels perfectly fine mind you i do have sensitive skin so it's not irritated at all now i'm gonna go ahead jump into the shower we're gonna use johnson's skin nourishing shea and coca butter body wash okay first of all this is baby baby wash and guess what i don't care whatever my skin loves i will give it to her and this makes my skin feel perfectly fine once again i do have sensitive skin and dermatologist recommends this apparently i'm not too sure about that but that's what the sticker says so i'm just gonna go with that but here i'm gonna go ahead and use a washcloth y'all you don't have to use a washcloth this one right here is really really soft and that's the only reason why i'm using it and my skin doesn't feel irritated at all but there are certain washcloths that really burn my skin this one right here is perfectly fine i got it at the 99 cent store so you can find yours at your local 99 cent store and i just scrub my body with it not too harshly at all as you can see i'm just putting soap on my body you know um scrubbing it down super super gently i know it looks a little rough here but guess what my legs believe it or not are the least sensitive parts of my body so <laughs> i could go as rough as i want over there and the shower is a perfect time to give your skin some tlc Okay, so another thing that I will be using is this Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula Coconut Hydrating Body Oil. Okay, there's vitamin E in here. And if you don't know, vitamin E is great for the skin. It makes your skin feel a lot more softer, smoother, and it just really helps the skin just get better, you know? And by that, I mean it's extremely healing for your skin anyways guys this is really good for stretch marks and the thing about it is every single time i use it on my stretch marks my stretch marks disappear but i'm not consistent jesus i need to be more consistent and by the way this smells absolutely delicious like i could literally step outside without putting on any perfume and i won't feel super super insecure because it just smells so good and look at it going on my body like as you can see my skin looks hella toned it looks like i am a, a, a gymnast and i'll be working out when i really don't because my skin looks so put together and toned then i go in with this jargons natural glow skin lotion y'all um i don't know 
myself I got this and it's supposed to be for like white people but whatever I'm gonna still use it but then I'm gonna go in with this pink basic vanilla perfume y'all this smells so freaking good oh my goodness it smells so good I brought okay so I know this product right here the Fenty lip gloss is not part of skincare but oh my gosh it smells so good and I feel like it complements this fragrance so well hyperpigmentation is completely normal like pigmentation hyperpigmentation is normal it's not a big deal like having dark underarms is not a big deal it's perfectly fine it's okay hashtag self-fucking-love <laughs>